Hey, man, I'm Fisk. I trade goods of all kinds. Hello, Fluffy Tails, I'm the Serious Squirrel, and welcome back to Gothic. In the last episode, we arrived in the barrier and are now in the old camp. And we're going to do some quests here. What do you think about that? As you can see, I'm in my uh, medieval attire, so we can have a real experience here. Let's see what we can find here, shall we? Uh, first, I'm going to talk to Diego because Tauros told us that we are pretty much his protege, so. I've talked to Thoris, and what did he say? He says that I can join the old camp if you think that I'm good enough. Looks like I have myself a new job. Do we start right now? First, there are a few things you should know. What do I have to know to be accepted in the old camp? If you want to join the camp, you'll have to earn some brownie points. There are a few influential people in the outer ring. Most of them are shadows. If you manage to impress them, it'll earn you a few brownie points. Then you'll have to stand the test of faith. Besides, there are a lot of skills every new arrival has to learn. The more you learn, the more valuable you'll be for us. Okay, what the fuck are brownie points? Where do I find the important people? Well, you're looking at one of them. Then there's Thoris, you already know him. As for the others, you'll have to find that out by yourself. If you don't manage to do that, you don't belong here anyway. Hmm. Just go through the outer ring and talk to people. Then you'll find out who's important. What's the test of faith? You have to go to the old mine. There you'll meet a guy called Ian. He'll give you a list. This list is important. It contains all the items the guys in the mine need from us. They'll get the stuff with the next convoy. No problem. Yes, there is a problem. The new camp must not get that list. Like I said, the list is important. If you do it right, you'll get much further. Okay. If the list is so important, why should Ian give it to me? Because you're going to tell him Diego sent you. I'll tell him. Makes sense. Uh... Where can I find the old mine? Go to Graham. He's a cartographer. Tell him that I sent you and that you need a map. It'll show you the way to the mine. He lives to the left of the north gate. All right. Take care. Let's get some work done. I've been talking way too much with people and yeah, I need to get going and do some quests. Hi, Mud. I don't want to talk with you. How's things? Not bad. If you can cook well, you have many friends here. <laughs> Makes sense. Would you like some of my rice stew? Thanks. You could do me a favor. Which one? What can I do for you? You must be used to good food. I have a new recipe. Meat bug ragu a la snaff with rice and mushrooms. Yeah, you can have as much as you want, but I still need three meat bugs and some hell mushrooms. Five should be enough. Okay. Actually, it doesn't sound that bad. Sounds good. Then go and see you get me the things. The last one I sent just hasn't come back. Must have deserted to the new camp. Oh, okay. Who was the guy you sent before me? His name was Neck. He was pretty discontented here. I think he's in the new camp now. I sent him to collect mushrooms, but he didn't come back. Well, I'm going to do stuff for you. Don't worry about it. I'm pretty good at that. Anyway, who are you? Fingers. I want to become a shadow. So? Can you help me? I wouldn't know how. But why? You wouldn't speak up for me in front of Diego, would you? Depends. If you demonstrate that you've learned something as a thief, we could make use of you. How am I supposed to do that? Learn a thief's skill. You need to become more skilled in sneaking around, pickpocketing, or opening locks. Then you'll have my vote. We can do that, I think. 
Uh, okay, I actually thought that you would teach me something, but apparently you're just gonna be a doofus about it. Alrighty, never mind. That's how it works. Hi. I want to join the camp. Can you help me? I might be able to, if you manage to impress me. Some of the best fighters from all three camps come here to compete against each other. Challenge one of them to a fight. I'll watch you, and if you're good, maybe I'll think about it. All right. What's your job here? I'm in charge of the arena. I organize the bets, hire new fighters, you know. Do you train fighters at all? Yeah, but not just for fun. If you want me to train you, you'll have to pay for it. 50 or 10 skill points for one-handed. I need to learn that at one point, because currently I fight like a pussy. I have to be honest about that. Not much I can do at the moment. But... There might be some meat bugs here. Yep. See, we can get those tasty buggers. If I can actually hit them. You know what? I actually think that we need to be fist fighting here. Yep, that works. That works with meat bugs. Well, that should be enough meat bugs. That's free at least. And we also have some from the beginning of the game. But now I want to equip my sword again, although I can't use it very well. But you might remember that we got the mission to get rid of Mordrak in the last Ladies. episode. Hey, newcomer. I'm Mordrak. You should remember that name. You can buy any kind of goods from me at a cheap price. Are you really the magician's courier? What if I am? I'd like to have a chance to talk to the magicians. I have to get inside the castle. The magician's couriers bear seals, which allow them entry to the castle. If you were one of us, you could get such a seal. Hmm. You have a problem. Really? What's that? There are people around here who want to get rid of you. Really? Then you can tell them they should send someone along to enforce their wish. What makes you so sure I'm not the one to do it? Because I think you're smarter than that boy. You'll soon realize that there are better opportunities than working for Gomez. We too need capable people in the new camp. And nobody tells you what to do. Hmm. And if I wanted to join the new camp, could you help me? If you're serious, we can go now. I can take you to Laris. He's the head of our gang. But if you prefer to beat me out of the camp, well, go for it. I doubt that's ever like No. Uh, we're gonna go to the new camp, but first I wanna do some stuff around here because it's a long way to the new camp. And I'd rather do whatever I can do here first. Hey, you! I train in swamp weed and potions from the sect camp. Do you want something? Uh, sure, show me your goods. Show me your goods. I got the best stuff here. That's just great. Anyway, we're going to sell this tumbler and this torch. We can sell the coin because it's not worth anything. Can also sell that. That's 25 ore so far. It's not bad. Let's get the ore. Because that's what I want at the moment. So I can pay some people. I want to join the camp. I want to become a shadow. Oh! You're looking for a chance to prove your worth? Good. You can do me a favor. If you do it well, I'll speak up for you in front of Diego. What is it? In the sect camp, there's a man called Kalam. Quite a big shot. One of the gurus of the sect. Kalam is an alchemist. He has the recipe for an effective healing potion. Mm. I'd like to buy the recipe off him. Then I can produce it myself. 
But nobody can get near Cologne. And what do you expect me to do? The sec loonies are looking for new people all the time. You're new here. Just pretend you want to be recruited. Cologne is one of the gurus. That means he checks the new candidates. If you get in touch with him, try to get the recipe. Whether you want to pay for it or you don't, I don't care. Sounds like a difficult business. How much is in it for me? At some point, Diego will ask me if you're suitable for us. Just guess what my answer will depend on. No. Okay. Okay, I'll see if I can get the thing. Where is the sect camp? Leave the camp through the south exit, then head eastwards. You'd better take a map. I got one here for 50 or. The south exit is the collapsed tower, isn't it? I'm not listening to Exactly. Yeah, well, I don't need your map. I know exactly where I have to go. Hey, man. I'm Fisk. I trade goods of all kinds. If you ever need anything, you're in the right place here. Wow. That voiceover. <laughs> have you got armor for me as well? Well, I'm sure that I can satisfy you. I'm sure you can. But costs too much right now. Anyway, we have a quest. I know a quest that we can do right now. So, let me just speak to that guy over here. Hi, I'm new here. What do you want from me? I want to become one of you. I want to join the camp. Looking for people to support you, eh? If you want me to have a word with Diego about you, you need to do me a favor. Okay. What kind of favor do you want? I want one of Fisk's weapons. He's one of the traders at the marketplace. Mm -hmm. You won't sell it to me. It's a broadsword with ornaments. No, oh, okay. I'll give you 100 ore to collect the weapon for me, but don't tell him about me. All right. Hmm. Okay, give me the hundred ore nuggets. I'll get the thing. Here you go. Come straight back to me. You know, he's trusty for giving me all that ore. But sure, why not? I'd like to buy a sword, but not just a simple one. I'd like something more ornamental. I have one you like. The shadow who wanted to collect it won't be coming anymore. That'll be 110 ore. Interested? Maybe later. That's more than he actually told me, so let's go back. I want those 10 ore. I won't pay from my own purse. No, sir. That's not what we're doing here. Fisk wants 110 ore for his sword now. And you want me to give you the 10 ore now? I thought you wanted to have that sword. Here, take it. And now hurry. Sure. Thank you. People are easily persuaded in this game. You know, sometimes. I'd like to buy a sword, but not just a simple one. I'd like something more ornamental. I have one you'll like. The shadow who wanted to collect it won't be coming anymore. That'll be 110 ore. Interested? Yes, give it. Yes, I'll take it. You got a good deal here. Thank you. Well, we got a quest done. It's actually good. It doesn't take so long to do a quest, actually. It just like to talk to the people so you get to know them a little better. I have your sword. Wasn't too hard, was it? Whatever. You do me a favor and I'll do you one. If Diego should ask after you, I'll speak in your favor. Until then, have a good time. Thank you. So, I think what we're going to do now is go with Mordrak to the new camp. And I might skip the way to the camp because it takes a while. 
but yeah, you will get to make yourself a picture of the new camp by that. So let's go. Let's go to the new camp. Okay, follow me. Let's go, Maldrak. Run, you bugger. We can actually get a little bit of experience on the way because Modrak will kill all the people, uh, not people, but monsters that are on the way and we can actually also get hell mushrooms while well, we're at it. So Modrak, please keep on running. I'll follow you and we will have a good time on the road. Let's wait here a little bit. Level up! That's what I like to see. If we can get enough ore, we could learn the better sword fighting technique when we come back to the old camp. It would actually be good to have that because it's easier to fight with it. Well, let's keep on running. Let's follow Mordrek. The guy who kills everything in our path. Thank you for that, Mordrek, by the way. You're a buddy. You're a brother. Brother! There are goblins here. Could you get rid of them? Thank you. Rusty sword. Goblin doesn't have anything for me. All right. Oh damn it! Another guy killed him. It's kind of shit. I don't get the, I don't get the XP for it now. Hmm. Damn. But I want that tasty XP. Are oh, we gonna have a problem here? I guess I have to kill the scavenger. Shouldn't be a problem because he's stuck anyway there. We were close to the new camp. And I love that Modrak goes and actually fights all the monsters around here. Because that really, really gives you a lot of XP. There's a Hell's Mushroom. Hell's Mushroom! The drugs the Hell's Angels take. Can we open that chest? No, we can't. We also need to learn lock picking as soon as we can because it really eases up the amount of tries that you have to actually pick the lock. And once I find a good lock to show you how it works, I will show you. It's basically just you have to hit the directional keys left or right in a certain rhythm and when that works out well, here we are. When you pass through the gate, you'll reach the new camp. Talk to Lars. He will help you. Give this to him. It's a precious ring. It's your ticket to see Lars. You need a good reason to be allowed to meet him. Okay. Well, thinking about it, I think I'll stay here for some time. I've earned enough for now, and things are heating up in the old camp. Mm. If you want, come and meet me at the bar. It's the hut out on the lake. Take care. See you. Thank you. Well, we're at the new camp and I think we're going to explore that in the next episode because if we go in there now we will find a lot more quests and then I have to talk to a lot more people and it's going to take a long time. Fluffy Tales, I hope you had fun watching this episode. Come back in the next one and as always, I'll leave you with a hearty goodbye. Goodbye.